triangle. So that's C6 right there, and this is L5. Very clear there. So I'm going to feel for that inflammation in there. Mustelor key, see? Yeah. Oh, a key. No, the other one. Yeah, that's yeah. at L5 right there. Very common, it's the last movable segment in a spine, mm -hmm. and that gets the most stress out of any disc. And C6 is posterior on the x-ray there. Okay, so let's check your SI joints, make sure they're moving up here. Over here. Right side, lift that right leg 90 degrees, and left leg. Okay, right, and left, and right side. So we're going to check this in a minute. They're both, they're both moving pretty well. The right side is restricted very slightly, um, but there's not a lot of ilium misalignment. The sacrum is rotated on the left side there, but um, we're going to check that motion once we get this adjusted, see if that comes back. The fifth lumbar is shifted back here posterior. And that's pinching off that nerve. So the way your body adapts is by tightening other muscles. When you have a subluxation, mm -hmm. muscles are going to start to spasm. So that's one of the reasons you feel like tightness in that yeah. area. But. Yeah, and your body's trying to stabilize you. Mm -hmm. it, it, it's really trying to splint you into a position to make you from getting worse. Okay. So we're going to set that L5 there. Okay. I'm using that x-ray to now. Now that's 4 and that's 5 right there. Okay, yeah. perfect. Okay, good. Okay, good. So that's C6 right there. And that's L5. Mm -hmm. So you're really cleared out with that. Yep. The pain, uh, it's more right now. It's like I can't handle it now. I can't sleep better. Sometimes I wake up and I feel a little bit, you know, of less pain. And uh, uh, it was much, much better than when I came first. I came first. Came. That's what you were saying, losing sleep. Yeah. Yeah. And that's so that's much better now. Yeah. Okay. That's what you were saying, losing sleep. Yeah. Yeah. And that's, so that's much better now? Yeah. Okay. Sleep better. And um, you mentioned the tightness. And like I said, when you're dealing with a subluxation, it will cause muscles to contract, mm -hmm. uh, to stabilize you. It's, and it'll cause spasm to sprint. But as that clears out, that motion will start being restored. The stiffness mm -hmm. will start loosening up a little bit. And you're well on your way. You're... Yeah, I noticed that on the neck. I had a lot of stiffness on the neck. Yeah. That's, that's pretty much gone. Yeah. Awesome. Awesome. Okay, thank you. <laughs> thank you.